Hello everyone, this is Paulina from Pencil and welcome to today's tutorial covering how you can record in Pencil Spaces. In Pencil Spaces, you have the ability to record whether or not you are in a call with different participants. As you can see, I'm not currently in a call with anyone else, but I can still access the recording function. Our recording function also seems quite similar to screen sharing. That's because you get the ability to choose which screen you want to share. This gives you the flexibility to either record the actual spaces session itself, but you could also choose to record something else on your computer. Let's say that you're presenting a slideshow. Similar to screen sharing, you have the ability to share an entire screen or monitor, a window, or a browser tab. In this case, I'll share a browser tab to show you the audio functionality. In this case, I'm going to enable sharing tab audio. Then click share. Now you can see that my recording has started. You can see that there's a red indicator on the recording button. In Pencil Spaces, you also have the ability to pause or resume your recordings at any point. Just click on the recording button again and click pause recording to intermittently skip a portion. Then to resume the recording, just click the recording button again and click resume. Now the, the recording has begun. If you want to end the recording, just click the recording button again and click stop recording. Once you click stop recording, the entire recording will end and you'll see a different pop-up that says save recording with a preview of your recording as well as some options on where you want to save it. By default, if you have access to the free version of Pencil Spaces, you will only be able to save your recordings to your device. However, if you have access to Pencil Premium, you'll also have the ability to save your recordings to the cloud, AKA pencil files. If you choose the cloud option, you can also click a checkbox to save your recording to both the cloud and to your device. If you do not want to save your recording at all, just click cancel. But in this case, I want to save my recording. So I'm going to click confirm and save at the bottom right corner. Once you confirm and save your recording, make sure that you do not leave the spaces session until the recording is saved. In this case, I'm going to click confirm and save. If you chose to save the recording to your device, you'll see that the recording has downloaded with the name of the space. If you chose to save your recording to the cloud, you'll immediately receive an email letting you know that your recording is ready. In this case, I can see that my recording for the space name is ready. Then you can click go to recording to view the recording in pencil files. That is it for today's tutorial on how to record in pencil spaces. If you have any questions, feel free to add them in the comment section below. We hope that this was helpful and thank you for watching.